Well, what we have is we have a DOT approved testing method to extend the useful life of SCBA cylinders from 15 years to 30 years, and we can do that test at a fraction of the cost. So what that represents for fire departments is that they don't have to go out there and outlay the cash to get new cylinders when they have perfectly good cylinders already in their firehouse. The process used is a testing method called modal acoustic emission. And what modal acoustic emission does is that can actually assess the structural integrity of a cylinder down to each fiber fracture, each flaw in the cylinder, and through the data we collect using modal acoustic emission, we can actually determine how structurally sound a cylinder is, how structurally um, defective a cylinder is, and then after that, determine whether that cylinder is good for extended life or not. So our company's been in the non-destructive testing industry for about 25 years. In 2018, we were purchased by a company called Hexagon Composites. What Hexagon specializes is in the manufacturing of carbon composite cylinders used in CNG, uh, hydrogen transportation, um, and alternative fuel markets. This is uh, Rosenbauer American Pumper sitting on a Warrior custom cabin chassis. It's a 96 inch wide cab. We also offer the Commander, which is a 99 inch cab. This truck's got 450 horsepower, Allison transmission, seating per six. Uh, what's great about this is a very strong cab, so it's built with 316 extrusions with all 316 inch skins, the door skins, the cab sides, everything is. 360s, as opposed to a lot of our competitors are using 8th inch material. So our cabs are very strong, 10 year structural warranty, they hold up very well. This truck features the Hendrickson SteerTech front axle with parabolic springs, so the, the ride quality is, is absolutely fantastic. We like to utilize this flat floor and promote this flat floor area, so there's no there's no humps, there's no step ups in the center of this cab floor, so when you get in the cab, there's no stumbling. Right behind the engine tunnel was our uh, clean air scrubber. This scrubber was designed in conjunction with Rosenbauer at the University of Minnesota to remove that nasty stuff that comes out of a structure fire. Those uh, VOCs and particulates, yeah, so it keeps the cab clean and free of those volatile organic compounds. A uh, pretty straightforward side mount pumper. This has got a Thousand gallons of water, 1500 GPM pump. I believe this is a Waters pump. Uh, we use uh, Waters Hale Darley, and then Rosenbauer also manufactures their own their own pump. Uh, this is our CRT body. This is a 12 gauge stainless steel bolted body. Thousand gallons of water. Some of the options uh, we can do the natural stainless, or in this particular case, uh, we use the line X material. And around the back, we've got a pretty traditional setup in the back here. What's really nice is the, the Rosenbauer Easy Climb gets you to the to the host bed safer than the traditional individual flip down steps. I think it's important to know that you know, Rosenbauer is a, a family owned business, uh, been in business for many years. We've got facilities in Minnesota, we build our custom chassis in Minnesota, we build uh, an extruded aluminum body. Uh, our airport our units or our crash trucks are built in Minnesota. Uh, we built uh, this body here and many other bodies in South Dakota. Uh, our aerials are built in Nebraska. And I believe uh, we're, we're employing about almost a thousand employees here in the United States.
a nonprofit and we're a 501c3 and we have the national which is uh, out of Arizona and his name's Dave Graybill. He founded Pink Hills in 2007 and he started going all over the country you know for the women and their families and kids. Uh, pink represents uh, females not just cancer we don't do it for just cancer we do it for all diseases and we take care of people in our community. We've got like six counties in our area and we take care of like people with that needs their co-pays, their medicines, uh, we help them with ramps, you know, just whatever they need. We help kids at Christmas, we help the homeless, so whatever the female needs, then we're there for them and their family. Uh, you know, Dave, he, he's a good guy and he's been all over the country to try to promote Pink Hill, so we're looking for more chapters in you know the states and stuff so anybody that wants to be a chapter uh, contact Dave Grayville and uh, you can find him on Facebook or you know you go on and see YouTube videos and we do home visits for people that can't come to us that's sick or whatever and they can come and, and sign all the trucks and uh, to start out with all the trucks was named after a female you know that was uh, battling cancer they lost somebody with cancer so, you know, now he just, he does it all, it's just Pink Hills. It's ncfoothillschapter.com. Uh, we've got a push button, you know, that you can go in there and donate a fund. This is what we do as far as our shirt sales. That's what keeps us going. We don't ask people for money, you know. We sell our shirts and get out here and work, you know, to, to help the people in the community.